two hand push press. So you're gonna bring your belly between your feet, whether you're using the dumbbell or a kettlebell, it does not matter. You're going to use, um, you're gonna get, start off by getting up into a goblet clean. So sit yourself back into your hinge position, bell's gonna come up into your goblet position, all right? From here, when you go to do your press, instead of doing a two hand stretch press, straight up, full body tension and come back down. Now what you're gonna do is use the power of your legs. So you're going to pop your knees forward, heels stay planted. So your knees only pop forward enough that you can use them for assistance. And then you're going to power through the legs as you shoot up to the top with your bell. Full lockout to pull it up. And then as you come down, you're going to absorb into your knees again. Exhale, walk out. Inhale, come down. So it is not a big drop forward or up onto the toes or, or squat even. It's not a thruster. It is literally just a pop of the knees to help assist in that boom lockout position, okay? So drop the knees, exhale, lock out, inhale, come down. Watch it at the top of your push press that you are not flaring through the rib cage. It is really easy to hyperextend through the abdomen here. What we wanna do is close back off in a straight line from fingertips all the way down to ankles, straight all the way through. All right, that is your two hand push press.